I feel them. Okay. So I'm going to show you my Minecraft world. Let's go up a little bit so we can see it from above. So I'm right now, I'm building a pathway from my village to the water. Let's go over here and have a look at my lovely little village. Now, I have been building houses and I've been building them into the mountain. And see all my little Minecraft people? If they have a bed, if they have extra beds and lots of food, they'll have little children. So there's lots of little children here. Let's go further. Now, also, from this height, you can't really see everything, but I have covered the mountains, the hillsides with flowers. And I have made many, many roads. This is a little village. They have their, they have their garden plots. See the blue dots are the water. With, you have to have water every so often. When you get down lower, you can see the detail more. I'll show you. Let's just come down here and have a look. We'll watch. So the guys with the yellow hats on, those are farmers. And they have a life of their own. You know, you provide for them and they carry on. They need something to do, which is, um, farming, but in order to be a farmer, they have to have these compost buckets. Once they have a compost bucket, they'll get a yellow hat. And if you till the soil for them, lo and behold, they will, let's go down lower. They will till the ground. Now I have some high rise kind of stuff happening here. And I've tried to put flowers on the mountain sides. Let's go look at this place. I'll just show you. Well, let's just go down here with them. Uh oh. All these brown spots, this is where um, the soil has reverted to soil. It's not. You have to hit it with a um, one of those things, a hoe. Let's show you. So we'll pick that one, which is number eight. Oh, that's number seven, I guess. And there's my hoe. So, oh, I gotta get some arm space here. Okay, so I, I, well, they always seem to get right in the way. Click on it and it'll change. And then he'll come over. That's a woman. She doesn't have a hat on. The women don't have jobs. They're mothers. But the men are farmers. Okay, so now these are my little water. Oh, see, he's planting it. There they go. He's planted that one, and he planted that one. Now they're looking at me. Oh, now he's harvesting over there. Let's see what he's harvesting. They all come and watch you. Look. They're kind of crowded here. I gave them so much food in their containers, in their chests. This is a composter. If you have a, a composter and some tilled soil, like you have to till it with this thing. Oh, you see, but see these black lines? That shows that you're, whatever you're going to do right now is that block. You have to move a little further and then you're on that block. And then you can can hit it and now it'll now let's see if somebody comes and plants it oh they planted it already and I didn't look oh look at everybody all oh, the farmers are coming oh he's gonna plant that one see they put their head down oh he's plant oh wait there you go if it's not planted for too long Gee, there's so many people here. There, he planted it, see? Now there's little green things there. So he's planted it, but this should, let's till this soil too. 
You have to be careful not to hit the people because you'll hurt them. Oh, here we go. Farmer has arrived. He's going to plant it. And this is a child. You see a little tiny child. Isn't that cute? He has a hard time jumping. Let's move over a little more and we'll do this piece. And can we do that piece? No, he's in the way. Oh, he's come to, he's come there. Oops. Now this vine there will keep you from being able to do that one. Oh, oh sorry, he got in the way. Look, they've already planted it. Boy, they, are, they need work. These guys are having, oh, he's planted it. I've never had so many farmers before. Oh, that vine is in the way. We have to get rid of that vine. Because if anything is on the edge of the block, did you see that? That just grew. This is wheat. When it's yellow enough, then they'll harvest it. Oh, it's growing more. You see that? Oh, we have so many farmers here. We need to spread them out, but I, I don't seem to know how to spread them out. Okay, have at it. Oh, oops. They get in the way. See, you can trade with them. So farmer, if you give them potatoes, you get a diamond or um, an emerald. If you give emerald, you get bread. But as you do this, like this guy is a novice, level one. I'm trying to get my farmers to be higher levels just because I feel like it. So I've got some chicken and some pork, I guess, which I could trade with the butcher. Oops. So if you touch the block they're standing on or their shadow, there. See if, it, if it's highlighting the block. You see the black lines around the edge of the block? There we go. But if you touch their shadow and not highlighting the block, then getting them. See all the flowers? I put flowers everywhere. See now, if I touch here, you think I'm on that block, but see these black lines here? These black lines are delineating this block. So if I were to click it, I would harvest that or something there. Hi, everybody. Look at everybody's here. My goodness. This must be a crowded city. What a lot of you. There's so many. Excuse me. Oh, he's there. Why, thank you. Let's see who you are. Okay, he's a level one farmer. If we trade potatoes with him, you want me to show you how that's done? Well, usually, if you're in survival mode, you've got to you've got to harvest your potatoes to trade with them. But if you're in survival, you just go to your inventory, and you see this one here is crops. If you click on that little plus, oh, and you also find this from this icon here. With the flower, that means growing things. So all this is growing stuff. And the next one is items you can make. And that stuff is metal stuff. And then you've got building materials. Okay, so here we are. Let's get our crops. So let's get some potatoes. So now if you hold down your shift at the same time as you click on it, and you can keep clicking on it. It'll fill up all your, your inventory, which if you go up here, you'll see your own inventory. See, now I got all those potatoes. Okay, now we'll get out of this. Okay. Let's see what we're gonna do here now. Get rid of that. I'll do this. One. Hello, little boy. Oops. Hello. You're just walking in the garden, aren't you? Oh, fall in the water. Oh yes, I put, in order to keep them from falling in the water, I put lily pads on them. Otherwise, they, weigh, they may 
get in the water and can't get out. Well, eventually they do get out, but let's go back here and get this. There we go. When he gets out, I'll put a lily pad there. Oh, I could put a lily pad on that one. There's lily pads. There they are. See? Hi, where's that farmer I was talking to before? Hey, we got a lot of growth here. It's hard to get around if you're going to hit your head on everything. Oops. Guess I got to put both legs down. Maybe I should have a little table. I should bring a little table from home. That's a vine. This was once a tree. Now it's not there. Okay, so what have we got here? Somebody's stuck in the water over there. Where's my novice farmer? Hey, who are you? See his hat? He's not wearing a farm hat. Oh, here's a farmer over here with a hat on. Everybody else is just hanging out in the garden. He's busy. He's planting. Uh-oh. I messed it up here, so let's plant that again. Hi. See, if I click on her, nothing. Click on her, nothing. But if I click on him, ah. See, he's a level one farmer. Oh, look, he wants beets. <laughs> Wrong farmer. Let's find another farmer we can trade with. Here comes one now. Just slow down a minute. Slow down, slow down. Okay. So he's a level... Oh, he wants beets, too. Good grief. Is that the same one? Maybe him. He wants beets. How about you? He wants carrots. See that? Huh. I have potatoes. How about you down there? He wants wheat. Look at that. Where did the potato guy go? Now that I've stocked up on potatoes. He's the carrots guy. How about you over there? He's a carrots guy. Good grief. Look at this. It's like they know. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't want any of your potatoes. Let's go away from all these. Come over here. We'll find another one. All right, farmer. What have you got? Beets. They want beets. Oh my gosh. What's with beets now? This is a cartographer. He wants paper. Hmm. He'll make maps. Look at all these farmers. Everybody wants beets now that I have potatoes. Silly guys. What's this? What's with this? Be nice if I could number them. Carrots. All right, enough of that. Let's get this, make this down there. We have to make it into a pathway now. So if we hit it with our this, it'll turn it into soil. But we want a pathway. Oh, everybody's leaving. Uh oh, look at that. Everybody's leaving. Sun must be going down. Look at that. Sun's about to set. Everybody goes and gets in their houses and goes to bed. But even though I have lots of beds, some of them don't go to bed. Okay, let's finish doing this. So we're going to make it into that. So we need to use a shovel. If you use a shovel and you click it, you can make pathway. See? That's pathways. Hi, ma'am. Why has she got green arms? And now this is a, what's this guy? He's got a different hat on. You know, you wear a different hat. That's your, your job is your hat. Oh, now let's see what they do. As soon as it gets to be dark, everybody goes and lies down. Oh, wait, that's my little farm. All right, well, let's just go and see where they're all going. Are you a farmer? Do you want potatoes? No, he wants carrots. Hmm. How about you? Unbelievable. Nobody ever wanted carrots. They all wanted potatoes. Now they want carrots. Come on, let's... Where are you going? 
Do you know where you're going to? Do you like the things that life is showing you? Oh, in they go, in the house. This is my house I made out of a tree. Want to see it? Where are you go? The first layer I usually put down some block. The second layer I put windows, and then the rest is block. So open the door, and let's see who lives in here. Oh, people have gone to bed, but she's not. He's not in bed. Let Let's see if he'll trade with us. He wants potatoes. Look at that. Okay, so now I take my potatoes and I put them up there. Look, and I get a diamond, an emerald. I mean, looks like I get lots of emeralds. Okay, let's put more dime, more potatoes up there. So you need 26 potatoes there to get an emerald. So now go back there. We get an emerald and another emerald. And let's give him some more potatoes until we can do this until he runs out of potato, or runs out of em or has ha has enough potatoes, I guess. So it takes 26. See, 26. Every time you want to get a emerald, you give him 26 potatoes. So there's 12 there. So not enough potatoes. So we have to add more. That's 12 more, but that's still not enough. We need 24. 26. That's too much. So now we do this and we get some more emeralds. Okay. Now we can keep doing this for a while. Let me see if I can... Oops. Let me see if I can put you here. I have a bit of a shine on. Shine on, silver girl. Now if I could put something here beside you to keep you right in order. Right in the right spot. Okay, there you go. Now I'm going to use, I'm going to put my finger down here, and I'm going to I'll click on this, and click on this, and then everything goes at once. I'm, I'm going to show you what happens when you do enough of these. Then you, it changes, so you won't take any more. Okay, see now, see how he's got an X there? Okay, now he doesn't want any more. And now, look, he's gone from, he's a level one novice, because nobody's traded with him before. Now he's a level, oops, sorry. Now he is a level two farmer. See how much he's got? So let's see about, we'll trade all of our emeralds and, and get bread. We don't want bread, but we'll give it to him later. So let's trade our emeralds, so we'll click shift and then we'll click on that and all of them go up there okay and now look I can click on that and I get I get these breads and no more potatoes let's, and I have no more emeralds oh yes yeah, see this it's got an X in it too so now we don't have any of this stuff so it's red we don't have diamond or emeralds or stuff, but, and we don't have any of them but we could get some, so let's get some. So we'll get out of that, and we'll go E, and we'll get some, what did he want? We need melons. Okay, I push the shift down, and I click on it, and it'll fill my inventory. See, this is my inventory box over here. So I've now filled everything up with ammo of those. I need to put my maps somewhere. I don't want my maps in there. I remember. Let me. Anyway, we're just gonna see now. See these little sparkles? That's because he's. Um, oh wait, I can't do that. That's locked. See, he won't take any melons right now. If I push that down, the melons will go there, but I can't get anything for them. So we need pumpkins. All right. E. Go to this. Actually, we should go to this. Let's get rid of our potatoes. We'll take the potatoes. Oops. Take the potatoes and drop them on that side so we have some room. We don't want any bread either.
Okay, now what do we want? We wanted some crops. Here we go, this one is the crops. And let's get some carrots just in case. Get one carrot. I don't want this glistening melon. We need some pumpkins. Okay, so now we got that to escape. Oh, shoot, I just broke a window. Okay, farmer, where'd you go? There you are. Hi. Now he wants wheat. This is a different farmer. There's our other farmer. Farmer woman, there he is. That's our farmer. See, he's got the hat on. Oh, sorry, my hand's in the way. Oh, shoot, I didn't mean to hit you. Okay. Yes, you're looking at me. All right. He went back to bed. Now he's up. Okay. Oh, he's, this is a different one. This is one's wheat. Maximum level farmer. Novice one. Now, instead of six pumpkins for this, he wants nine. All right, let's give him 64. Okay, see now the X? See, he's got enough pumpkins. And I've got some diamonds. Okay, let's get rid of this one and we'll get the d emeralds, I mean, not diamonds. We get more bread. Who wants bread? Hey, I didn't want bread. I was going to get this. Oh, but we can trade melons now. Okay, so let's. Here's our melon. Okay, so we'll hold down the shift and we'll click that and then that. We can click that again. See, now he's had enough melons. X there now, but he'll he'll sell us. And he wants. Oh, he won't take any more pumpkins or melons. And we don't have any wheat. And we don't have. Oh, we have some of them. We could have bread, but I don't really want bread. Let's see if we can get apples. So we'll click on those. Oops, we have to get this out first. Oh, there's nowhere to put them. We'll just throw them away. Put them off to the side and then they disappear. But you probably don't want to do that. Okay, so here we got some bread. So now we've got all of his bread, all of his pumpkins, all of his melon. Sorry about the way you're having to sit here. All right, and we could trade some for some apples. So we'll click on that. Now we're going to get apples. There we go. And we've got some apples. We don't have enough emeralds left. There we go. So those are the ones we threw away. Okay, you can go back to bed now. Good night. Okay, we'll go and check out this guy. Click on him and he'll stand up. Hello, sir. We'll click on him again. Ah, he wants these things. He wants wheat. Let's get some... See, he's a level one farmer. So we can... Are you bored with this yet? All right, we aren't going to do this anymore. Okay, goodbye. We'll go outside. Oh, wait. Oh, look, the sun is up outside. Now everybody's going to get up. Nobody's going to sleep anymore. Everybody goes out the door. They shut the door in your face because they really don't care. Let's make this into some... Should we make this into farmland here? Give them some more stuff to do? Boy, that's quick. Well, now we're going to need some water in the middle of it. So put the bucket of water. Oh, shoot! Not up there! How'd that happen? Oh, no. Now we need an empty bucket. E. We'll go to stuff you can... Stuff made of metal. No, stuff is in here. Here's an empty bucket. So we have to have an empty bucket. And now we click on the empty bucket and look. Oh, you weren't able to see that at all. And the water just disappears. Look at all these farmers. Busy, busy, busy. Now we'll 
come over here. We have to put it in the hole. And let's put a lily pad on top. Look, we already tilled it all. Well, let's go and plant this then. We better put some water in the middle. You have to have water within four blocks of the will rise up. But if there's something growing on it, you have to get rid of that first. All these farmers need things to do. I've got so many farmers. Okay, so we're not going to have enough water here. So one, two, three. We can have water four blocks away from the one, two, three, four, one, two, three. So we'll put some more water here. Put a lily pad on it. You don't have to put lily pads on it. I'm just tired of them getting stuck in the water. So you notice what's happening here. If there's already something growing there, you can't till that block. And see how the blocks, if, they're, if there's enough water, they'll turn dark. But if there's not enough water, oh. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. We can actually be eight blocks apart. Lily pad, where's that lily pad? Okay, just a minute, farmers, just a minute. Have to get rid of the grass on here. We have to go back here. Now you have to be careful you don't make holes. If you click the wrong thing by mistake. Oh, now see this dried up. If you happen to click a farmer by mistake, he'll think you want to trade with him. We've already done that. All right, here they are. Fixing, fixing, fixing. All right, now you have more stuff. This one you can't click on because this vine is here. So that vine is taking part of the block, but now you can. There you go. Now see how dark it is? The dark is because the water is soaking into the ground. Now this is better, isn't it? You guys didn't have enough land. Here, let's just make you some more over here. Just holding the button down and moving around. All right, let's put some water here. So if you don't have water, everything will dry up like a desert. See how dry that is? Soon it'll turn dark brown. Doing our, now see how light that is? Oh, but it's turning dark. Where's our water? Okay, so one, two, so you can go four blocks away and still plant. This is Minecraft for seniors, I guess you know that. Eh? Okay, one, two, three, four. That's too far. One, two, three, four. Funny, this. Oops, let's just put water over there since I made a hole. Put this on it. Put some more water over here. Okay.
All right, now let's fly up in the air and see what's happening here. Well, there we go. We've got all these farmers have more things to do now. Hmm. Oh, you want to come over in the flower area? See, these hillsides are all flowers. See, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? See? All those flowers. And they can go for walks in the flowers. And they've got some gardens here. Oh, looks like things dried out. If they didn't have enough stuff to plant... Uh-oh, 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 look it, I broke my thing, now I need a block, see I got a block of grass there, okay, get our till thing, oh, and here they are, farmers are at the ready, this probably won't grow very well because there's no water here. Everybody wants to plant them. But there's no water. See how many waters I've got here? All right. Uh, see, I can't put water on the corner there because it'll, it'll run down. We could put water here, though. All right. Now those should darken up. You like all these pretty flowers? Oh, and we have bees. Bees like flowers. And they get honey. See, this is full of honey. And this is the drip. But in order to harvest the honey, you put a campfire under it. So let's get a campfire. E. And a campfire. Where's that? Let's I'll make this big. Campfire is here. All right, we'll throw away those flowers. Now, if I put it, see the honey is dripping? There are three bees that go in here, but if you build a campfire under them, you smoke them out, and then they won't bother you when you harvest it. Now, in order to harvest the honey, you need some bottles. So let's go get some empty bottles. So that's stuff. Let's see if we can go down to the bottom here. Where are our bottles? Here's the empty bottle, okay. Oh, that's an enchanting bottle. Here's the empty bottle, glass bottle. All right, let's get rid of our composter since we have enough farmers. So number two is our glass bottle. So we'll click on it with our glass bottle and I have to get rid of our, our empty bucket, too, so we have room for this glass bottle. See, it's gone. Now where's my bottle? It fell down here. Hmm. All right, let's harvest these. Let's see what we can do over here. There, you see? full of honey. Mmm. Okay, we'll put a fire under it. And then we'll get our glass bottle. And you have to have room in your bar. We'll click on that. Look, now we have a bottle of honey, and that's empty. Look, we have another glass bottle. The bee came out. Sometimes the bees will get mad at you, and they'll come after and sting you. If you're in survival mode, they could kill you. <gasps> Terrible, dreadful. Where's more of them? Let's go over here. I put I put them on top of the trees because I just figured that was a fun thing to do. Look, no, none of it. There's no honey in here. What's wrong with this picture? Oh, let's go over here where the bees are. Aha, honey. We'll just build a fire in the tree. We'll take out that. Oh, look, the honey is dripping out. 
We'll put a campfire there. Ha, now we get our glass bottle. Wait a minute, we have to have room for this. Let's look in our inventory. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. So we have, oh no, I can, we can stack them. So there's two there now. That's okay. So we'll click it with the empty honey. We'll click that. And now the empty, the honey is empty. See, it was full. Now it's empty. I've got my third glass bottle here. Okay. Now over here, if we don't build a fire under it, see, we get the bees will come out. I even put them over here on the bamboo. I put, I mean, I put the bamboo here so I could have panda bears. Oh, bees come out. But I've got the honey. If I were in survival mode, they would be upset. Oh, ho, ho, they would have red eyes. Be attacking me. So I wonder how much honey I've got now. How come it's not showing the numbers? Look, now it says a seven there. See? I've got seven honeys. What can you do with honey? You can build with it. Well, no, you can't. You can build with honey boxes. These are empty. Well, that's because I've got a fire in them. All right. Shall we go check on some other honey? Or are you bored with this now? How come you are up on the tree, Iron Golem? He is one of the security guards. I'm going to make you fall down. Where you go? There, now we can roam around and keep the peace. If there's any bad guys, he'll, there are no bad guys because I'm in survival, not in survival mode. Think, do you like the flowers? And the pathways in between everything? Look at all those composters for a roof. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe that's why I've got so many farmers. Because everybody will take one. I wanted to build a roof, but I didn't have any blocks that I felt like using. Now we should have a lot less farmers. But let's, we, everyone needs a job, so let's give everybody a job. So let's see, this is the stuff. So this is a crafting table for making stuff. That's a cartography table, a map maker. Fletching table, he makes leather, I think. Smithing table, I forget what they do. Beehive, campfire, soul fire, furnace, blast furnace, smoker. What's a respawn anchor? Brewing stand, anvil, grindstone, Enchantment tail, bookshelves, lectern. So if we put a lectern here, and let's see what else we're going to use. A lectern and a cartography table. We're done with our fires now. A fletching table. All right, let's see what happens if we build out of that. They can't get up here to use them, though. Hi, guys. So, all right, now if they have no hat, they're either a woman or they have no job. Let's come over here and we'll, oh, there's the doorway. So we want to have them have room. Let's, let's put something here. We'll put the, the cartography table there. So now somebody will become a cartographer. They'll get their different hat. Oh, is he the cartographer now? Oops. Now I've jumped in the bed, and if I wait a moment, it'll be bed. The bedtime will be over, and it'll be daytime again. There we go, daytime. So what are you? Look, he's got a new hat. He's a Fletcher. What's this one? That's a Fletcher. And what other people have we got? Nobody yet. Let's put. Let's give somebody a. A fletching table, and that's the blast furnace. 
Oh, now we've got those little green things. That must mean somebody's becoming a cartographer. All right, well, let's go out of here. Sometimes it's kind of hard to get out. You have to be on the ground and you have to walk straight through the doorway. Nope, you can't stand on the bed, Nancy. Away we go. Okay, look at these flowers. It's a beautiful place. Oh, what is this? Look, different kinds of jobs. Look, he's got some... What is he? Let's go find out what this hat is. He's a weaponsmith. Weaponsmith. All right. Let's put down some stuff. We'll get rid of a flower, and we'll put down a... What is that? A fletching table? Oh, we only need one. Uh-oh. Now we have to fix our road. And let's see. Let's put somebody here. What would we want? Let's have a lectern. We'll have a librarian. And usually they'll go stand by their block. Oh, here comes somebody who's not you. You're a farmer. What's this? He's the Fletcher. And that is the Fletching table. Oops, that's a lectern. Oh, now we wrecked our pathway. All right. So I built this nice building up here. And then I realized that I wanted an upstairs. And so I had to give them a way to get up there. So I put all these stairs to go up. And then from up above, we need it. So here's. What have we got here? This is the blast furnace. So we've got two things here. This one is to upgrade your gear, and this one is a blast furnace. I'm for, I don't know what you do with a blast furnace. And this is a woman's. Oh no, it's a toolsmith. She has no hat. <coughs> Why have you had no hat? And what are you? Ah, he's an armorer. And see, you've just created new jobs for these people. He's now a Fletcher up here. Oh, fridge is open. They just need more things to do. So everybody won't have to be a farmer. And then I don't have, I had so many people, and they would walk around at night, and I didn't know what was going on. Look, the flowers, they're facing the sun, they're sunflowers. Maybe we'll give you, we'll put a lectern here. See if we'll end up with a librarian. Oh, and this is the main, this is the Zocalo. It's where everybody comes and hangs out. Uh-oh, there's a bee stuck under there. Dripping honey. Hi, guys. You going to go for a swim? Oh, here comes the librarian. Look. Here she comes. He, she, it. Oh, flowers looking this way. So this is the librarian over here, going over to stand by the lectern. There. Now, if you need anything from her, let's see, what have we got? She's a level one librarian. So she wants paper, and she wants books. If you give her that many and a book, she'll give you an enchanted book. But a book, a book is a really cool thing. You can write in a book. Let's get a book and show you. That would be under stuff. There's a book, but this is a book and quill. Let's take this book and quill, and let's see what this does. Number two. Okay, so here's my book. And if I open it, I can write in it. Today, we have many farmers 
there. And now we can sign it or we can just close the book. There we go. And then I can carry the book around with me. E. I could put it, this is my own inventory, this one over here. So put the book here. I could put it in my offhand. No, I can't. Put it there. All right, so we have a librarian. Hi, librarian. So let's get, let's put some more things for people to do. Let's spread everybody out a bit. There's too crowded here, isn't it? We'll put a cartography table here so somebody can come and make maps. And what about, what else have we got? We've just got the fletching table too. So we have a fletching table and a cartography table. There we go. And let's go somewhere else. Spread the folks out. These guys, this is the top of a roof. See this nice place? I've been creating all this stuff. Let's go down here, down the stairs. This is the house. It's not very spiffy. We'll give him a cartography table here. Well, he can be a cartographer too. See, that is a campfire from this other house down here. See, this house, they have a lot of stuff. That's another house in there. <coughs> How come I have two doors here? Well, anyway, so in these chests, you can't get to the chest. Can't open. Okay, it's empty. All right, we put all our stuff in there. Get rid of all this stuff. And then they will. Of course, this is. If they have enough stuff, then they'll, then they'll um, have babies. And there are more people. It's getting to be a crowded city. There we go. And you can put the honey in there too. And we'll put the book in there. Okay. Want some bamboo? Put some bamboo in there. Okay, now what's in this one? To move that so we can open it. It's empty. Well, things are different now. I guess we don't need that there if it's empty. We'll just put a cartography table there. Hi, anybody want to be a cartographer? Pick your poison. Okay, here we go. Oh, what is this? He's a level one Fletcher. Hi there. So what do you make? Let's see. Oh, I guess he makes bows and arrows. Okay, out we go. Okay, that was enough of this. We can't go up, we have a tree in the way. All right. Now, I have maps here. Do you wanna see the maps? Where is the map place? Here's the maps. I've been mapping the whole village, the whole area. So these are the maps. I had, I ended up labeling them. So every time I made a map, like so 108 was this one, which is the same as another one, but these are all the different areas of maps. And this is when it's all put together. I've been trying to put it together. It's another bigger one here. So I can see what's what. Those are all the little houses I made. Where are they? So that's a map of what this area looks like. So if I, if I get a map right now, E, if I go into here and find a map, which is not a living thing. There they are. 
So there's an empty map, an empty locator map. Empty locator maps are good. Okay, so now I click on the map, and it's over here. Now if I click on it like that, it puts it in there. So let's go and open it up. Okay, so this map is now showing the area where I'm standing. Now that's me. So if I walk forward, I'm going over top of things. See this white thing beside me? That's this building, right? So once I'm on the edge of the map, okay, now if I get another map, two, click on that. Uh-oh, now it's gone somewhere else. Oops. It's gone up in my inventory somewhere. This was number 151, so this is 152. So this is what's right beside the first map, right? So I'm into a different area now. So I click on this. Now I'm out in there. Oh, so this is what comes beside it. Now let's keep going. See, we're getting to the shore. See, I'm getting over, getting toward the water. Go right to the edge of the water. I'm out now over into the water so I get another map. Need to make, oops. Um, I'm going to click on something else here so the map isn't in the way. Okay, I'm going to get rid of something else from the inventory. I have to go to E. Let's get rid of our water bucket and our lily pad and our cartography table and our doors. And now this is 151. Hey, don't pick it up again. 151 is there. 152. These are other ones. 147. 101. 149. 46. Okay, so now and get a new map. I click on it and it puts it beside it. Then you go to that part, number one. Now you've got this. So now we're on the ocean. Now you can see this isn't finished up yet. So as you walk, it finishes it up. Okay? Oops. So let's get out of that. Let's go to number three. There. So we have the water and its location as relative to our Thing. Now, if you want to put your maps down and look at them, you've got to get some of these little, um, a frame. See an item frame? So you put your item frame down, and you have, we have three item, with three things, right? They're in a row. So let's get number... 153, and we'll put that, oh, you have to get over the item, and put three, and then click on it, and it low, it puts it down. So now let's go to there, see? So our map is there. Let's move forward, let's put down 152. So we have to go into our own inventory. This is 152. Okay, so that's number four. So we'll put this thing over the item, number four. Now we click, and then we get out of it so we can see what we did. Look, it all lines up. And then we move over, and we're going to put down the next map, E. So this is 151, 153, 152. So 151 is next. That's over here. So we'll put that down. Now let's get out of it so we can see what we've done. Look, this is our, this is where we are, and this is how to get somewhere. See? Now this locator map is green. Anyway, that's our map. 
So you want to go play in the water? Hey, donkey. Let me see if I can ride him. Oh, oh, oh I'm on. Oh, he kicked me off. I'm on again. I'm on again. When hearts go up, then he'll like me. And then he'll be tame. Come on, donkey. Oh, he's hard to tame. Oh, I'm sorry. I hit him. I have to be careful to only use the right, the proper one. Boy, he's not taming. Usually you just do it two or three times. Maybe he's a mule. Oh, he's a donkey. Burrow. A burrow. Oh, did you see that heart? Now he's not going to kick me off. Okay, now we'll see E. Look, we have a donkey inventory. So this is the donkey, and he needs a saddle. So let's get a saddle. Now we have to get off of him, and we have to go into our inventory thing. We have to go to created stuff. And I think the saddles are over here. Here it is. Saddle. And we'll click on them again. Now we're on, and then we go to E, and we'll put our saddle up there, and then we'll get out of that, and now he'll go where we tell him to go. Now we can ride him. Look at this. We'll ride the donkey. Oh, we're stuck. Okay, now we can go. He can just climb right up. Oh, away we go. Rub a dub dub and away we go. What a crowded village we have. Oh my gosh, this is a city for sure. Rub a dub dub and away we go. Away we go. Away we go. Rub a dub dub and away we go. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. Oh, oh, we came right in the house. But I'm too high. I'm getting stuck on something here. Anyway, there you go. Now we're in the middle of a village. Who wants to be in the middle of a village? This is a busy, busy village. My goodness. Look, I can jump everywhere. Sort of. Come on, let's go walk under here. See, but that is in the way. I'm too high up when I'm riding him. Why isn't it going? Why can't we go? Oh, you can jump over everything. Sort of. What's the matter here? All right, well, that's enough of that. Let's go up here. Oh, I see. Yeah, he can't get in through the bamboo. He might get caught between the bamboo. Yep, we're stranded in the bamboo. Should we go see a polar bear? Okay, we're going to get off the horse because it's a little hard to walk on this ride on this horse. Oh my, we have a tunnel. Look at this, what a nice tunnel. Hmm. Make the tunnel a little wider. It takes longer if you're doing this with survival mode. All right, where are you, Mr. Panda Bear? Oh, there's our horse. 
Now if you don't want your if you don't want your mule to get away, you can do the same thing with horses. Okay, so here comes all the bamboo. I just broke it. So all those chunks. Oh he came right over. Rub a dub dub and away we go, away we go. Let's just break all this bamboo. Was that fun? Look at this panda bear. Come back down, come down. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to hit you. Oh, panda, hello. I'll give him a I'll give him one. Look, he's gives me hearts. There's a nice little tunnel down here. Get rid of those, and it doesn't have a roof there. Hi, want some more? I can give it to them with a. You throw it to them, and they'll usually sit up and eat it. Oh, sorry. He's looking for another one. He wants to have a baby now. All those hearts. I'm ready. Where's my wife? Let's find. I want a family. Look, there's some more over there. There's my donkey. Now, if you want your donkey not to get away, you can put a lead on him. So you go to E, and there's a lead right there. You see that? You have to get a lead. And number two, you can put it on him. And now look, he's you've got him. Actually, <laughs> he's. We can fly. We can fly. He's flying. He's flying. He's bouncing on the lead rope. All right, let's put them over here on top of the tree. Okay, well, down you go. Want to go on the tree? Uh oh, I didn't mean for him to fall down. Okay, now if you want to put the lead on him, you have to put a post. I wonder if you can use bamboo. I don't think you can put bamboo here because it's not dirt. Ah, but what if we put some soil down? I've got to get close enough. Put down a block of soil, and then we'll put some bamboo on it. The bamboo will grow. And now we'll take a lead. Oh, my lead fell down. Hi! I'll put it on him. And I'll put it on the bamboo. No, it won't work. Oh, we need a fence post instead. Okay, let's get a fence post. E, we'll go to building supplies over here. We'll get a fence. See if we can put a fence right on the ground here, right on the tree. Look at that. Now we can click on, take our lead. And we click on it. Now he's attached to here. Hello. Now he can't go away. He's on top of the tree. Every horse wants to be on top of a tree, don't you think? Look at this bamboo jungle. All the bees over there. Oh. The sun is rising. Or is it setting? It doesn't seem to be moving. Why isn't it moving? Oh, it's rising. There it goes. Sunny day. It was a sunny day. La da 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 da. Now you see these dots in the thing? That's because it's not showing you the trees that they're sitting in. Oh, I guess they're in bamboo. Now we were making a pathway a while ago to the water. That's where we started out. 
Let's see if our pathway is somewhere around here. Rub a dub dub and away we go. Where's my pathway? Oh, there it is over there. If you push control at the same time. Well, look at this. The pathway does not go through. Let's make the pathway go through, shall we? I hear our companions. Yeah. I guess it's not raining that hard. I don't think so. Today is the day for making signs. Uh oh, I missed a mess here. I'm gonna just put blocks of grass in there because it's easy to get to. But this is sand. Sand will fall. Gravity affects sand. When you're in survival mode, it doesn't go... Our um, awning is falling down. We have to get that fixed. There we go. Pathway through the mountaintop. Okay, see what you can do? Okay. Now we made a pathway to the water, sort of. Now we have to make pave the pathway. So we'll take our gonna make it a smooth double wide pathway. Okay. We'll get rid of it there too. Okay now we will make it we'll take our shovel. Is anybody here? Oh, two people are here. There's only so much playing Minecraft you can engage in, isn't there? Unless it's a rainy day. It was a sunny day. Isn't it relaxing? It's so nice. That's what Flatland B Mixer. Hi, Flatland B Mixer. I'm Nancy. I'm in Canada. Where are you? Why can't I jump? Oh, it's because I'm pushing the down button. You know, Minecraft, it gives you a... Oh, you're in Canada? In Min, Min, Winnipeg. Nice. Cool. I'm in Ontario. We are on a service mission at the moment. See how I spend my time off. I'm going to replace that sand with some grass. And I'm going to do this to it. Winnipeg. So have you got warm temperatures now or cold? I always think Winnipeg is so cold. But it's a dry cold, right? Okay, so I'm going to replace this with grass. So that I can make... Oops. But, you know, instead of doing it that way, it would be easier if I just go get... Now this is, this is under soils, or no, under here. No wait, it's under this one. So this is my dirt path. So if I get a dirt path block instead of grass. We had a terrible winter, one of our worst, and it's finally starting to get nicer out, but we still had snow three weeks ago. Isn't it amazing? Boy, this, this earth is a changed place. Hi, Susan, you got here. Good morning. I've been playing Minecraft because it's a rainy day. I'm going to go down there and make my scripture signs for this camp. Not yet. Not a lot to do when it's raining. Oh, you were at the pharmacy. Aha! Stocking up. Okay. It 
to you, how does this look? I have to get rid of that. We can't have something hanging over our heads like that. All right, well, building a path is fun, but it's kind of boring. Let's go and let's make a boat. E. Let's get a boat. It's out of a made item. Where are the boats? The boats, the boats, the bo it'll have a plus on it because there's many different things you can make out of them. Is this it? No. There it is. There's the boat. So, what color do we want? Let's get a red boat, an Akakia bark boat. And now we'll put it in the water. Okay, and then we'll click on it. Ha! And now we can go for a ride. Let's all go exploring. It's never boring. Hey, there's some bamboo there. Oh, you can only turn around so far, you see. You have to turn with your with your things. If you turn the sound on, oh, I have the sound turned off. I don't like the sound, but because it gets to be pretty noisy. Well, this is a relaxing place. Let's have a picnic. Should we have a picnic here? Here. Now, in order to have a picnic, here, let's have some cake. Have your cake and eat it too? All right, where's the food stuff? I think it's in here under this living stuff. Crops, there's seeds, and there's, there's crops. What about cake? Where do you find cake? Cake might be under a uh, made stuff. Let's have some cake. not there. So, cake is not there. Oh, maybe it's miscellaneous foods. There we go. Okay, cake. Let's have some cake. We don't need another boat. We have the boat. So put our cake down there. Would you like some cake with me? Cheese and sausage, Susan suggests. Well, let's just have cake. I'll have a bite. That's yummy. Would you like a piece? Mmm. This can be our picnic spot. We can be ready. All right, let's get some other foods. E. What else do we want to eat? Let's see, we have... How about pumpkin pie? Let's have some pumpkin pie. But I think we're going to need... I don't think you can just put the pie down. I think you have to put it on a frame. An item frame. Okay, so put down our, let's see if we can put it down first. No, so put the frame down. That's your plate, and now I can give you a piece of pie. There you go, piece of pie for you. Oops. Should we get something else? Let's have some more pie. This is where everybody can come and have a, a picnic. This is a glamorous picnic, so we call it a glicknick. That's Willem's word. All right, so we have pumpkin pie and cake. Let's put some more item frames down and we can have some more things. What else should we eat? Let's see. Hmm. Go back here. Let's find the food again. Oh, it's under, under that stuff? No. Here. Where is the food stuff again? Oh, it's over in the in there. Cooked food. Should we have some cooked food? Uh, how about a rabbit? Should we have cooked rabbit? Who wants rabbit? Oh, and you want something else? You don't want rabbit, eh? Rabbit is a little bit weird. Okay, how about chicken? Would you like some chicken? All right, you can have chicken and you can have rabbit. 
And how about something else? What else have we got in here? Um, mutton or beef. A lot of people just like regular old beef. Oops. Okay, there we go. So we've got beef, rabbit, and chicken, pumpkin pie, and we can't turn around that way without turning our boat, and cake. All right. Oh, it's getting dark out. Well, you know how you have to get out of this boat. We should turn up the sound, eh, so you can hear it splashing. Oops. Got to go this one. So turn up. We go to down here. And we'll go to audio and we can put the sound on. Hear all that sound? I hear an animal. I hear a cow. Cow. Look down under the water. I don't want to get lost. We're going to go back. There we go. There's our Glicknick spot. Hey, we better make a sign there that says Glicknick. Oops. Have to be facing the right way. Okay, we'll put a sign here. Let's get a sign. E. Sign is under made things, is it? How about under those? No. This stuff. No. Rub a dub dub in the way. We go. Where's our signs? Let's go down and see if it's down below. <gasps> it's thundering. Okay, and I find the best sign is the birch because then everything shows up. Hi, Willem. Hi. There's the wa there's the towel there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we'll put a sign up here that says Glicknick. <laughs> Hi, Willem. <laughs> G L I C N I C. Glicknick. <clears throat> Not. Picnic, P-I-C-N-I-C. -I -I there we go. So now we push escape, and now it's on the wall. So that's a glicknick. And let's put the position here, too. Oh, I missed it. What was it? 404, 62, negative 81. 404, 62, negative 81. 404, 62, negative 81. That's important. All right. So we have to back up and turn our boat. Uh-oh. And let's go back and see if we can get home. This isn't it. Whoa, did you see that? Somebody's spamming my channel. I have to get rid of it. Oh, there it is. The path. Okay, let's put a sign here. It says 
this is our position, our GPS. 312, 6280. 312, 6280. Okay. And we'll get out. So you just click that, and now you're not in the boat anymore. Now you're out of the boat. All right, let's go up in the air. Double click your space bar to fly if you're in survival mode. All right, let's go back to the safety of our village. We'll just fly over the pathway. We have many pathways. This was the original house. This is where we, it all began. Look, they even have a table. Isn't that nice? You know how to make a table? You take steps. I'll show you. Here we go. Get some steps. E. Now that'll be up in here because that's building materials. And now I've used green steps, so let's use the same green steps. And we need um, put that there. And now you have a table, another chair. But that's all we can have here. Hey, but this is too wide, so we could do something in the corner here. Why don't we build a, a laptop? So we'll, you have to click, this is a block, right? So you have to click on the top. If you click down here, it'll make it proper stairs. If you click up here, I think the seam is there. So we'll click it there and it'll be, see now it's upside down? And if we want to make a Tape uh, a laptop. Let's see, what was it we used for the top? I forget. We could put a an item frame there, and then we could put an item frame here. Oh no, you can't. You can't put anything on here now because there's something already in its space. The space above it is occupied. But we could put. Now you have to back up. And we'll have to put the chair, see the back of the, the bottom corner of the chair is going to be, ooh, not that one. I'm going to do this. There. Okay, let's go over here, see what we made. There. It's supposed to be a, a, how do we do this? I forget how to do this. So, um, if we put, we could put a black carpet on there, E. Now, carpet, that would be under made stuff. Nope. Under nature stuff? Nope. Under this stuff? Nope. Must be under here. So, what's this? This is wool. And this is carpet, wool carpets. So, we'll take a black carpet. Get rid of our beef. And we'll put our black carpet just that one. We'll put that on there. And what about this one? If we put a gray E, put a gray carpet down. No, we don't want a carpet. Now we want a trap door. I think a trap, no, no, a block. We'll get a block, a gray block of, maybe a smooth stone will work. There. Does that look like a, a screen? Not really. Hmm. It's supposed to be our computer. If we put another one beside it, we can put a, a mouse on it. Let's get a mouse. That would be a button. Button, button, button. Which hand has the button? Not there. How about this? No buttons there. How about here? Maybe it's down at the bottom. It'll have a plus on it because there's many different kinds of buttons you can get. Nope. It's got to be here somewhere. Let's go back to here. There's trap doors. There's no buttons there. You see any buttons? How do we go down?
buttons. That's a lever. Here's a button. Okay, let's get a black button for a mouse. All right. We'll put our button on here. Okay, that's our mouse. Hmm, this doesn't look so good. How are we going to do that so this looks like a, a laptop? I forget how to do that. See, because we've already got the carpet here, something is already in this block, so you can't put something here. So maybe if I change, I don't know. What should I do? How could I do that? Hmm, you could use a trap door. Let me see if I can do that. Now you see it's going <clears> to <throat> number three. Oh, it's going the wrong way. If I go outside <clears throat> and put a trap door there, maybe it'll stand up. I guess I should plug it up. Okay, let's go this way. Hello, farmer. Now I'm going to get distracted. Okay, so here's our spot. So let's come stand right in front of it. Over, over, over. And we'll put a trap door there. And then we'll close it. Aha. Okay, now let's see what that looks like. Probably not like a computer, eh? <clears throat> there is a way to make a laptop. Nah. It should have been closing here, not closing there. Maybe if I put it this way, and then I, if I go over here and put it on from this side. No, that still goes the other way. I do it from there. Still goes that way. Oh, well, I don't know. should I do? We'll abandon the idea. Put some a glass back. Oh, I know. I could put a decorative block. That's what I'll do. I'll put a decorative block to make it look like something's on the screen. How about this one? I don't want to lose my maps. All right, so we're going to put this decorative block there. That's my computer screen. Let's look at it now. Eh, pretty good. Well, <coughs> let's see if this people have any food in their chest. Oh, look at all that food. Here, you want 64 pumpkin pie? You can have that too. Do you want a lead? How about some bamboo? Okay, that's it. Now you have lots of stuff in your chest. See, when it gets dark out, they'll come inside. Close the door. We need, you know, don't leave the door open. Oh, we need a lights on this, don't we? E, let's put some... Let's put some pretty lights, put torches on the wall. Four. There. Okay then. Well, have you enjoyed yourself? Isn't it fun to play Minecraft? You can use up lots of hours doing this. I guess I should go take that shower and make those signs. What time is it, Willem? I have a watch here. Just a moment. Oh, it's five after 11. We decided we would not meet at nine this morning. We would meet at noon because it's um, raining out. 
Yep, see, this is where we are. This is where we are. Ta da! There's my Willem. <laughs> well, it's been nice hanging out with you. Did you like having a tour of all that I've been playing with, all that I've been doing? So Flatland, you might not have been here when he was there, but Flatland BMXR. B what did I had a planet BXQR. We had anyway, so BX BXMR. He's from no BM whatever. He's from out west. North of you. Okay, Susan. Well, I hope everybody's had fun. Look, 91 minutes. I'm using up my data yet again. Oh, well, but what am I going to use it on? I mean, what better way than to spend time with you, showing you all my fun? Susan says, hi, Willem. He can't hear you. He's got his ear earplugs on. He's doing music. Or he's learning Chinese. He's been learning Spanish. You know, he's got uh, on YouTube. Whenever we watch stuff at night, you know, he would rather watch Spanish or Dutch or... Um, uh, bridge, not really bridge so much, chess and, and, and math, you know, trying to figure out the equations. Anyway, but now he's, now he's into Chinese. I don't know why he's into Chinese, but he's trying to learn the Chinese sounds for the characters. He's really something else. His brain just does not stop. He is definitely my equal or superior. He is very smart. I like smart people. Okay then, well, it's sad to say goodbye. Ah, departing is such sweet sorrow. I'm gonna play my violin, I guess. I have a few more minutes. I mustn't spend all my, waste all my time creating things in Minecraft. So what did you learn today on here? You learned about uh, making pathways, making soil, um, planting stuff, giving, giving uh, villagers occupations and their hats and trading with villagers and water, how you need water to grow your crops and panda bears. Nap time already. I didn't sleep very well last night. I was sticky. I should have taken a shower, but the showers are a long way away. We don't, we have an outhouse out there and I made an outhouse chair. Oh, did I show you that last night? I should show you that. I'll have to show you on another video. It's a pretty cool outhouse chair, but our awning has sort of fallen down. So we're kind of stuck. Oh yes, we had a picnic and we went boating. And we showed you how to make maps. Boy, this is a pretty, uh, this is a pretty um, Minecraft for seniors. How to play Minecraft. It's very relaxing. Panda bears, donkey, how to tame a donkey fill up chests for the food for the villagers and harvesting honey. We've covered a lot of things in our 95 minutes, 93 minutes. <laughs> you can use a lot of time doing this, but it's more productive than Facebook and it doesn't fill your head with all kinds of ideas that might may or may not be true. And do you really want to figure out what's true or what's not and who's telling you the truth and who's not? Oh well. Thank you for coming. It was really nice to be here. Oh, should we have a little prayer, a closing prayer? Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much for this opportunity to hang around with my friends and and make new friends and to play Minecraft and to do interesting things and create things that are in my brain that I actually can't do because I don't have the materials or anything in real life. It bless us now that as we get on with our rainy day that we will be able to be productive in real life. And these things we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Shower time. Yes, you'll have to watch from the beginning. Yes, but you got here. That's it. You got here in the end. Well, you can do this at home. Results may differ. And have fun with Minecraft. It's so nice. It's just so nice. You can cover the mountains with flowers or animals. or I do all kinds of fun stuff in here. As you can see by the amount of inventory that's available, you can do all sorts of stuff. Alrighty then, comment, tell me what you do in Minecraft. Bye-bye. See you later, Susan. See you later, Flatland. <laughs>